So, hello everyone. Um, long time no see. Uh, last time I was speaking about how to design these tabs uh, and, and then how to set up them. We have uh, small changes. So, for example, this price, which is on the one of the swatches, when you click on it, it changes on the uh, on the main price. Everything works smoothly. But what I wanted to talk is about that quantity breaks by BPI when it's introducing a solution to add these quantity breaks for variable products, which is very nice. So I will show you how to do that in a moment. So firstly, uh, let's change to variable. Let's go to attributes. We have already blue, gray and size medium small then let's go see if attributes everything is good let's go to variations generate variations once again okay I agree created for my for me All right, everything works. Sorry for the zoom in. Um, so now what I need to do is to add a price for each of them. I'm gonna add 100 euros because my current, oh, for, sorry, dollars. So 100 each and save changes. I'm gonna update the product And what I wanted to see is that my product from this one will change to, to variable. Example, give me a second. So yes, we have these variations, everything is working. Now I want to make it more beautiful. So let's go to quantity discounts tab and let's add an offer. So let's see, one quantity, total price 100, label one item, description only, one item, uh, just an example, quantity two, and let's have quantity three, total price for two quantities, we can make like 130, uh, two items, view description, let's make, you can share with your friends. Oh no, let's do this on the three items. On the two, let's add it. It's perfect to have extra. And let's make batch text, for example, best offer. Let's do like that. More interesting, right? Uh, for three, price is like 28 let's say uh, which is, doesn't make any sense nobody will buy it but I will take two and three items as a label now in preview settings I can see how does it look like uh, pretty neat uh, then what we need to is to update the product And let's refresh the page, the product page. Boom. Everything works. Uh, price is also changing when you click on it to 80 to 80, 100, 100. And of course, adding to the cart works quite well. So you can increase the OOV for your product and to make sure that you're gonna make more sales. Also, uh, when you go to earnings tab, uh, we improved this table a little bit so you can see that, um, for example, this one was bought two quantities for 120 uh, in the past. Uh, it was used by quantity bundle blocks. So you can uh, you can see all, all the analytics here. 
was happening and uh, with watch type was bought the most. So, yeah, probably that's it. Thank you very much for watching it. Uh, hope you like it. And uh, see you later.